Good day, one and all. Thank you for joining us here at WSKI TV 17 or at our website, WSKITV.com. We can find this forecast year-round, brought to you by 45 North, serving breakfast and dinner every day of the year in the Sugarloaf Mountain Hotel. And it's a long weekend, so everybody wants to know what the weather's going to be like. Enough of the hot weather. Back to more normal temperatures on Saturday, 68 to 72 for a high, so pretty pleasant. It will be cloudy, though, with a 40% chance of showers before early afternoon. We could get a quick tenth of an inch to quarter of an inch if it comes on through. Northwest winds a little bit noticeable at only five miles per hour. So don't let that interfere with all your plans, but do keep it in mind. And for Sunday, just an outside chance of an early morning shower. The rest of the day remaining mainly cloudy. So not a really super day, but on the other hand, doesn't look like there should be enough precip to interfere with any of your plans. It will be cooler on Sunday, 58 to 62 for a high, 40 to 44 on Sunday night. On Monday, Again, mainly cloudy with a 40% chance of showers, 62 for a high, 50 for a low. Then on Tuesday, wouldn't you know, when everybody has to go back to work, mostly sunny, 50% of an early morning shower, 70 for a high, 46 overnight. And then Wednesday, nothing but sunshine all day long, warming right up to 76 degrees, getting down to 49 on Wednesday night. Mountain bike trail conditions are pretty generally great in Carabasset. There are still a few trails closed as we continue to see spring develop into summertime but certainly a lot of great riding out there and if you would like to help contribute to the efforts nine o'clock in the morning be ready to start your work at the sugar Loaf outdoor center on saturday you might already have plans to be there but if you don't show up all hands make light work carabas at valley bike is now at valley crossing and bob is there ready willing and able to help you with all your mountain bike issues with local knowledge like nobody else around here and atv trails are now open for the season as well there's the odd closure here and there but overall everything looking great for the same as mountain biking mud season has gone quickly so the trail riding is super from kingfield up to the canadian border flagstaff lake scenic tours kicks off their season this weekend plenty of great summer days make sure you book to take a trip now with jeff hinman on flagstaff lake Copeland Co-op, if you want to do some gardening this long weekend, stop by and see all the delightful things that grow or decorate your garden with Copeland Co-op in downtown Stratton. And also in downtown Stratton on Saturday night, it's Foggy and Friends entertaining. This is the 10th annual Stratton Eustace Food Pantry Benefit. So get up there, super worthy cause, this Saturday night. And on Sunday morning, you got to get out to Tea Pond Lodge and Cabins to check out their new brunch menu from 9 till 2 o'clock in the afternoon with five new Bloody Marys as well. Sounds delicious. Remember to check out our quad cam. It's there 24-7 and with the summer weather coming and going, really cool to see the clouds roll in and roll out. And if you want to know what's happening at any time from anywhere, we are your source of information like nobody else here on the main high peaks. Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, in addition to our website, wskitv.com. Know before you go.